Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel. At last, we have reached the end of this Vue.js complete course. It's time to wrap up the course. So, what we have learned in this Vue.js course is we have learned the Vue.js basics. We have learned about the components, how to create the components we have seen, and also we have seen the syntax and all those things, data, computer properties, watching, and all those things we have seen, even handling, so how to send from parent to child, child to parent we have seen, and also what we have seen, so dynamic asynchronous components also we have seen animations and transitions also we have covered the course mixins teleporting render functions these all things also custom directories is a easy concept only it's a small concept only so you can do your own so these also we have seen and the latest concepts what are the things in, introduced in the vue.js 3 we have seen composition api and we have learned the state management ux state management so vuex is the thing which which will, which will uh, supported by the vue.js we have seen and also routing concepts also we have implemented the routing concepts almost all the concepts we have implemented so for server side uh, uh, for server side rendering this is the next concept we will learn so this is these are all the more almost all the concepts we have learned in the vue.js those these are the basic over, overall introduction if you want to go as a beginner into the vue.js now next is the concept is up to here you have learned is this sufficient for the vue.js course or if you want to go more deeper into this vue.js course what are the things to be learned what I can do, what I can prefer you is, so try, uh, try with the TypeScript support. So why? Because Vue.js, actually Vue.js is developed with the, Vue.js 3 is written in the TypeScript only. So if you try to see here, Vue.js 3 is written in TypeScript only. So you try, you try the project with the TypeScript also. So how to try, how to do the project with the JavaScript with the, in, uh, in, in the JavaScript rather than with the TypeScript. So write, try to implement with the TypeScript also. So then you will be able to understand. And another one what I can recommend you is, so you can also take a look at this Nuxt.js. What is this Nuxt.js? Nuxt.js is a Vue.js framework where you can develop the applications using this framework. Okay, so it will provide you some uh, full-fledged features and simple and powerful. It is, it is a simple and powerful and full-fledged features it will provide you. So you can also implement server-side rendering code. Okay, server-side rendering code means the code will be executed from the server because of this SEO purpose. Why? Because the Vue.js everything is a client side. Angular is also a client side. So this way is not an SEO. If you are develop a single page application, it is not a SEO site. So if you use the server side rendered, so Nuxt.js supports server side rendered and you can develop an application, single side, single page application and it is an SEO, SEO friendly it will be. And also you can develop normal client side application or static website also. If you want to develop, you can use. So if you rather than using uh, downloading types of uh, Vue.js and all those things, you can use this Vue framework and develop an application like this, okay? Just like the Next.js and the Angular Universal, how you are having for the frameworks, different frameworks. For Vue.js also, you will having Next.js. And if you want to learn more about the more about the designing and all those things, we have a Vuetify material design framework. So just like for the Angular, we are having Angular material, right? So for the same scenario, we will be having the Vuetify. So you can also use this Vuetify to uh, get the material designing and another one if you want to develop the mobile applications so if you are interested in the mobile applications and you want to develop with the Vue.js means i can suggest you with the ionic with the view so you can use this ionic with view so ionic supports the view version react js and also the angular also it will support so you can develop an ionic mobile applications with the view also so you can take a look at this ionic uh, also we will cover we will cover the course with ionic with angular in the angular in the future courses and ionic with you also will try to come will try to cover the course and if you want to develop native web application using the mobile means we have another thing that is nothing but the view native so it is developed more heavily dependent on the react native just like the react native it will be there but the language we'll be using will be the Vue.js. okay so you can use the view native also to develop a native application so these are the different types of things what you have with the different versions Vue.js. so these are the things what you what you need what you will be learning if you want to move further into the Vue.js course if you learn to learn more further you can learn these things okay so Nuxt.js right now i think it is supporting Vue.js 2 only so most probably in the coming it will be released with the Vue.js 3 support also if it supports if it supports with the if it comes with the Vue.js 3 we will also cover a course in the Nuxt.js okay so this is what I can tell you about this Vue.js. So before closing this one, so these are the concepts what I can tell you. So if you want to learn more about this one means I can whatever whatever things I have told you. So you can go with all these courses. So to become more familiar in the Vue.js. Okay. Now next in next in the um, before 
after closing this one we will, we will come with a new course i am try i am thinking of to start with the angular ngrx so we will try we will start with the angular ngrx if you want to learn more about another course or anything just uh, let me know in the comments i will try to do it in the future also so hope you have a good career or good future if you want to learn with the if you want to continue with the vue.js hope you have a great career okay so if you have if you have any doubts or any suggestions as usual so please post the comments below to this video or below to the any video i will try to give you the reply if i know and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel so that for me it will be an encouragement for me to uh, do more and more courses so like this front end development courses and also the back end development courses also soon we will be doing after completing these all the front end development courses okay node js laravel these all things also pending in our uh, playlist so we will soon try to re resume these all playlist also we will try to do okay have a good have a good career and a good future so have a good day thank you